In our opinion, Spider-Man has got the best rogues gallery in superhero fiction. When we look at reimagining a Spider-Man villain, we look again what's what's classic about the original design, um, and also how do we tie it into our narrative. How can we get a character that's existed for decades, and how can we do our spin on him so that it's modern and very specific to the game? Look out! Electro's probably one of my favorite villain designs. And it was one of those things that I looked at his design, I'm like, the green and the yellow are, are iconic, so we should definitely keep that. In our Electro's origin, what if his face got scarred? But they're not just randomly all over the place. They're actually in the shape of the starfish mask. Ultra, I'm time no see. Ultra was one of those that we knew we wanted because he could fly, and that presents a really fun challenge for the player. What I really love about Vulture is that classic green that he has, but also modernizing his suit. So we actually gave him a flight mask. And if you look at it really carefully, it's shaped like a, a vulture's beak. Rhino is the one-man wrecking machine. Pure strength, pure anger, just wants to get out of that suit by any means necessary. Within the Sinister Six, he is the strongest, the biggest, and not the smartest. What Scorpion does for Spider-Man is he challenges him not only in his speed, but also his traversal. But what makes him most interesting is that big, huge, long tail. So we chose Mr. Negative because we wanted people right away to know this was a different, unique experience, something they haven't seen before. When we first meet Mr. Negative, we only know him as Martin Lee. He's the nice guy who Aunt May works for at the feast, and they run these homeless shelters. What I really like is that you see Martin Lee as Peter, but you see Mr. Negative as Spider-Man. You have that ultimate version of two worlds colliding. This is gonna be something they haven't they haven't played before. So you have this mix of threats. Mr. Negative, he is truly the dark side of himself and of everyone. You have a big rhino stomping at you. You have Scorpion with the tail coming out of there. You have Vulture striking from above. And then you have Electro who is striking you from a distance. And there's one more villain that we have not shown yet. I promise you on September 7th, you'll understand why he's my favorite.